Hey everyone, it's Pamela here for Trans by Deaf. Today I'd like to talk to you all about um, the cost of transitioning. I've written a, a bit of a list on um, all the different things that you need to, uh, that you would need um, if you're transitioning and um, I think top of the list I think it would be um, psychiatrist costs. I'm not sure how much that costs in uh, in America, but in Australia, to, the gap is about $170 so, um, for a first visit. Um, then you have doctor's visits, which can cost you $60 and you get back, oh, I think it's $45 um, doctor's visits. You need a lot of those. Um, you, should, you should always you should continuously be seeing the doctors for blood tests and things like that as well. So. Um, then the next on the list is uh, laser hair removal. Um, you got to get rid of all the hair on your face as much as you can. And I spent about over about two years. Spent five thousand um, dollars getting that removed. And of course, there's the cost of estrogen, uh, which is uh, which costs me currently about five to six dollars a week in. Um, in it with it for the estrogen um, and that that's actually not the expensive part I think that's the cheap probably the cheapest one of course you've got makeup costs I reckon I spend about sixty dollars a month um, on that and uh, hair I spend about forty to eighty dollars a month um, uh, for instance like even like like if it's forty dollars, that's like that's a bit like usually it's uh, me doing it my, my own hair. Um, but if you if you want to go to the hairdresser once a month, that's eighty dollars. Um, it's a good idea to to do to do that. Um, along with um, laser hair removal is um, some people can you can get teeth your teeth looked at, um, which can be really expensive. Um, you can get them laser cleaned as well, so you can get. Which I think can cost teeth can cost like you know, on the low end of scale two thousand dollars all the way up to twenty thousand um, dollars to get your teeth done there. there. Um, and there's clothes, which is uh, I mean earlier on in transition, clothing can cost you like a lot of money. And I think the good thing to do is earlier on is to try second hand clothing just to, until you get an idea of what you like, and then. You can move on from there to better clothing, so or, or more something that you like, but still clothing, you know, varies and can cost up to a, I don't know, it's anywhere between twenty to a hundred dollars a month, really, just continuously, uh, and that's just you know sort of ongoing costs, and um, of course there's the cosmetic um, things that you can get done as well. You can get um, surgery, um, SRS or GRS or whatever you want. To to call it, um, that can cost anywhere between ten thousand and one hundred twenty thousand. Um, depends where you, where you go. Um, probably best. I mean, the average cost would be twenty five thousand uh, to get a GRS. I mean, there's other kind of co cosmetic surgeries you can get and get um, facial surgery, cosmetic facial surgery, and um, breast implants surgery. Uh, there's also injections, breast injections. Um, I know how much the injections cost. It's about to make any like to make one cup difference is about six thousand dollars per breast. And of course, you can get facial injections done, which is four hundred dollars a consultation. Um, you can also get more laser skin uh, fractioning uh, technology that they have at the beauty. Place that, that that can get rid of wrinkles and it's very good for your skin. Uh, that that can be you know four to six hundred dollars a consultation as well. So yeah, there's definitely a lot of money involved in finances um, in that. So I think that overall the, the costs are kind of reasonable because it is what you look like. And I mean, a regular women do this stuff all the time, and men do various things and buy expensive suits and nice shoes and things. So. I, you know, it's an ongoing cost that you're, it's maybe just a bit higher over transition, but if you're looking at getting surgery, then you're looking at a lot, you know, a fair bit of money and things, so.
yeah, well, that's all I have to say for today, and I'll talk to you all next time. Bye.